Okay, here we go. Ah, hello, Blazing Blade. Hello, Mastazar. It's Oblivion! Ah, I'm gonna be taking frequent breaks to cough. I had a cold, so my voice is extra sultry, but it also means that uh, I have a lot of crap in my body that I have to hack up. We're gonna be playing Oblivion! Uh, this is also the first Elder Scrolls game I ever saw played, and by saw play, I mean played. This was my baby. It was not until later that I saw others, but this is Oblivion. I've streamed it before, last time with Slyo9, uh, and I did some one-off streams here or there, like doing some dumb shit with it. Uh, I made a YouTube video about how to do powerful things in it, but we're going to be doing something different this time. And I'll kind of explain it as things go. Um, we're going to look at Patrick Stewart for a second. I was born 87 years ago. And that's enough for that. Okay, yeah, Mold Drifter Armor. I don't have any of those mods installed. I just have uh, the very barest of mods. And what we're going to be doing, like the stream title suggests, is we're going to be taking a a pacifist route through zero deal uh so we have to think about what that means uh there is a little pain when i get into the game that will show our characters assaults and murders and how many things we've killed uh, we want those numbers to stay at zero if at all possible. Uh, so we can't do anything that counts as assault. We can't kill anybody. I would prefer not to use weapons of any matter. Um, I'm going to have to turn the music down at some point. And I don't want to just rely on summoned creatures. Because I don't think, A, that probably counts as your assaults and your murders. Uh, but it seems like cheating. Everything else is... Uh, Three Laws Compliant Pacifism. I, I think we're doing No Kills Technical Pacifism. Uh, so we, we're, we're going to be doing plenty of crimes. We're, we're going to be stealing a lot. And we are going to be tricking other people into killing people for us. Um, we're going to be doing that a lot. So first up, we have to decide what our races are. And there are two that come to mind. Actually, three that come to mind. The first would be an orc lady. Uh, orc ladies have no penalty to intelligence, and they have 25% resist magic, but they have pretty okay physical stats. But they have minus personality, which is not good, because we're going to be using lots of illusion spells. And their other daily power is for killing things. So, not that useful to us. The other one that I thought of would be a high elf of some variety. Because we're going to be using lots of spells. And high elves have the most magic. But they're pretty frail. It means if we get into a situation where I have to, f where I have to put up with being hit by attacks or uh, magic, uh, I can get murderized, especially if it's magic. Yeah, I have heard of the High Elves, uh, but what I think we're actually going to use is a Breton. Bretons have almost as much magic as High Elves do, and they have resist magic 50%. And their daily power gives you 50% shield for 60 seconds, which is actually going to be very useful in this dungeon. Uh, Atronach sign, we'll think about Atronach sign later. Definitely not for the tutorial. And I could just load at the end of the tutorial. I have a save at the end. But that save file has kills on it, which I don't want. And I want to show that it is possible to play through the prologue without killing anything, which I did a run through earlier to prove that it was. So we're going to be a female Breton. Uh, let me look at Bretons. Why did I want to play as a female one? Breton. Oblivion. Males have plus 10 intelligence, plus 
10 willpower, minus 10 agility speed and endurance. Uh, oh yeah, it's because I have no minus speed. You give up minus strength instead of minus speed on ladies. And since we're never going to be hitting anything, our strength doesn't matter much except for equip load. But we are going to be running away a lot, so we would rather be a lady. So we're going to be a Breton lady. And let's let's take a look at the face. Okay, actually, let's, let's get a hair that is conducive to face sculpting. Uncle Phil, you got to kick that man's butt! Thank you for the sub, asterisk, asterisk. Okay, we'll do, we'll do, uh, we'll do oiled for now. And we'll, we'll, let's do some face surgery. No more, I yield. Alright, let's, I'm not going to spend forever on this, but I do want to make a respectable lady. A real lady you can really think is just very peaceful. What, 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 uh, does a light face make you feel peaceful or a heavy face? By the way, I am also streaming this in my Discord server. If you are a cool, you can hang out and watch while I play. Uh, Lucy says big face. Okay, big face. Big face is friendlier, so we're going to go with round. Although I don't want to just make Granny Smith again. So maybe... No! I know what this is. If we're doing big face, we're just making... Uh, Chiquita Dave. No, I can't make Chiquita Dave. No, no, no. I refuse to make Chiquita Dave. Can I make Thomas the tank engine? Maybe. Ooh. Okay. Big anime eyes. Very moe. Yes. Uncle Phil, you got to kick that man's butt! Ah, thank you for the for the prime sub Teen Wolf Dad. See look at this. Look at this coy little face. Yeah, I wanna go wide. That's kinda Granny Smith, but Okay, we're getting somewhere. I'm kind of making E.T. Oh no, Battle Angel Polita. <laughs> oh no, I'm making Frasier again. Why do I keep making Frasier? I have to not make Frasier. The Frasier is mostly the hair. <laughs> Battle Angel Frasier. <laughs> I got a cough. <laughs> okay. Yep. Look at this. Isn't this a face you can trust? Getting a little bit berries and cream. 
And I've got the nose. Make one of the elf bowling elves. We're kind of there. <laughs> Is this Frasier? To you? Have I done nose already? No, it's just the necromancy I've done to the face has already done a number on the on the nose. Hmm. Now is a big nose or a little nose more peaceful? Which one of these is more peaceful? I think the little one is probably more peaceful even though I like the big one more. Okay, now this changes everything. See, this seems peaceful to me. Like, this is just supremely peaceful. <laughs> Kai win? Yeah, the Kai was peaceful, right? Oh no, I, that, that did bad things. That makes her frown. That's not good. Yeah, like a peaceful. That makes her smile more. Yeah, just a little long to sniff out good deals for everybody. Peaceful. No, do not randomize face. Okay, now we got to choose a nice. Ought to be, got to be bright. Bright and cheery. Now, if I mess with this too much, she will become too grotesque to deal with. So let's not do too much. Yes. Okay. See, this is what I mean by becoming kind of... The colors get kind of grotesque. Okay. I'm kind of getting Pinocchio. Okay, so let's pick a nice, peaceful... Okay, the most peaceful color I can think of is like... Okay, not the Joker. I don't want Joker green. I want, like, sea foam. Not neon. Be closer to here. Yeah, like a nice sea foam. Yeah. So let's let's take a look at the hairs we have. Got the rogue knot. The loose combed. Now is longer hair or shorter hair more peaceful? Red is not peaceful. Red is the color of conflict. Okay, military, that has bad connotations. Natural. Natural sounds very peaceful. Loose. Loose is also pretty peaceful sounding. Ponytail. Now that's now that's idyllic even. Very peaceful. But twists? No. Twists are violent. No. Violent. Cropped? No. Violent. No, I destroyed. Cool brown is pretty peaceful. But I think we gotta go with sea foam. Court? Mm, the law is kind of peaceful. Wind braids sounds very wind bound. Wind bound is not peaceful. I think it would I think we're going with wind wind braids or natural. Those are the most peaceful sounding, and I think natural is the way to go. Okay. So this is uh this is our 
our Breton lady. I can mess with her complexion, which will ruin her face. Oh. Now, what's more peaceful, a young lady or a grandma? Look how much I've ruined her just by touching one thing slightly. Hey, right, we're going to go in the middle. Okay. And what am I going to name this person? Not Battle Angel Eli uh, Alida, but Peace Angel Niles. There we go. And we'll call her Paz. But her real name is... Okay, no. Paz is short for Peace Angel... Zeniles. Peace Angel Zeniles, or Paz. There we go. There we go. Uh, yes, I want to be a Breton. And now it's time to turn the music down. Okay, now I do a trick where I press escape to start running, open my inventory, and then press escape again. Pale skin, snotty expression. You're a Breton. I always forget how fucking fast you can move in this You're game. Nothing but a stuck up heart with cheap palmistries. Go ahead. Try your magic in here. Let's see you make those bars disappear. No. What's the matter? Not so powerful. Now are you Breton? You're not leaving this prison till they throw your body in the lake. Oh, that's right. You're going to die in here, Breton. You're going to die. Hey, you hear that? The guards are coming. For you. <laughs> okay. So let's take a look at our... at our. Uh, this is the only mod I have installed, is the UI mod. For some reason, if I try to uninstall it, the game crashes on launch. So I, I've just left it on. Plus, it's just better. <laughs> oh, you played as the most unpleasant woman alive. You, you were channeling Pipe, huh? So here's our stats. <clears throat> here's the important part. We have 50 willpower and 50 intelligence. This means that we will have lots of magicka to deal with. The only bad news is we have 30 endurance, which means we're very squishy. But if we go over to this pane, it'll show our accomplishments. So you can see all the stuff that's happened, all the things that have done, our bounty, our fame, or infinity. We have our assaults listed here, and our murders listed here. These are going to be numbers we're going to have to be very careful about, because uh, these are going to be the ones that matter. We don't want to commit any assaults, and we don't want to commit any murders. We might have to, at some point, commit an assault. But even more important are... Well, these I don't think we'll, we'll ever have to do. These two are going to be the other important thing. We have creatures killed and people killed that'll show like here's if we're a good person or not here's if we're a pacifist or not everything else is going to be fine including jokes told but the important one are going to be so this is how we're going to keep track we're going to have to periodically check this page to see if we've ruined anything uh, basically everything else is going to be fair game though and the other thing I forgot to do is the last time I played this game I played it on Hard. Uh, this is supposed to be in the center. There we go. 50 is the default. And I had it at 100 when I did my playtest earlier to see if you could even get through the tutorial without killing anything. I was like, huh, why are these rats killing me so quickly? And it's because they were doing six times damage. No, they're dead. I know it. No, I didn't mean to pick that up. Get out of here. Uh, how do I... Right, it's, uh... My shift key got stuck. There we go. My job right now is to get you to safety. What's this prisoner doing here? 
This cell is supposed to be off limits. Our usual mix up with the watch. I. Never mind. Get that gate open. Stand back, prisoner. We won't hesitate to kill you if you get in our way. No sign of pursuit, Stay put, though. prisoner. Good. Let's go. We're not out of this yet. We gotta talk to Patrick you? Stewart some. I've seen you. Let me see your face. You are the one from my dreams. Then the stars were right. This is the day. God's gift. Up, oh, sorry. Don't care. Why am I in jail? Doesn't matter. Want some rye? Of course you do. Please, sire. We must keep moving. My friend left. <laughs> yeah, tangible human skull, and he left. Everybody saw it. Ah, oh, there he is. Don't try anything. Da, 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 da. Ba, ba, ba. Is there a, no, there's not a chest up here. Up, oh, I lost Jeffrey. Later, Jeff. So we're gonna work our way through the tutorial. You've seen all this before. We're gonna come up here. I'm mashing the E key. What can I do for you? Hmm. With all the farms in Nibane, there's still plenty of forest and wilderness open for settlement. Uh huh. With all the farms in Nibane, there's still plenty of forest and wilderness open for settlement. Mm hmm. Well, let's see if we can't uh, persuade. Yes. Okay, uh. Ah, uh, disposition is maxed. Okay, I can't make him like me anymore. Okay. Let me see. Close up left. Protect the Emperor. <laughs> Mmm, repairing the orrery. <laughs> Is this fine? Okay, now we need potions. We're going to need lots of potions, probably. Nothing else these losers have on them is any uh, use. I guess I can take her steel short sword and torch for money. Stand aside, prisoner. They'd be waiting for us here. Mm, how could they? No, it's too late to go back now. Don't worry, son. We will get you out of here. They won't be the first to underestimate the blades. I'll take points. Remember how they completely retconned the blades in the Skyrim? That kind of sucked, didn't they? Well, it wasn't me that the assassins had the problems with. It was, uh... There's two rats. Rats love to jump. Ah, piss. Piss. They clogged the hole. Okay. We're going to take arrows because they're money. And I'll, I'll take armor and the weapon for now. Even though I don't think I ever want to use them. Uh, lock picks. So, the rats might give me a disease, which would be a bad thing. Yeah, this is much more bearable when the rats aren't doing six times damage. Okay, so we're just running through the tutorial. There's going to be a zombie up here. Hey, dude. Actually, one second. I've never gone up here before. Ah, there's nothing up here. Hey, the rats killed the zombie! Good on you, rats. Six gold, very important. Yeah, well, I was dying before when I was doing this, and I thought it was because my endurance was so low, and it said, no, I had the difficulty jacked all the way up. That would make a difference. Rats. Yeah, there's a lot of rats. It's just, It seems like there's even more when you're not killing them because they all kind of like pile up behind you. No, do not punch. 
No, don't hurt me, I'm a friend. Okay. There's gonna be a goblin up here. Yeah, sneak past the goblin. Piss! The goblin found me. Now this... That wasn't... That wasn't murder. That goblin died and it wasn't me. You all saw it. Like, look. Yeah, that wasn't me. Now here's something I want to check. Does this count? Okay, that's not on me. That wasn't me. I just I just touched some logs. Why would they do this? That poor goblin was just in the wrong spot at the wrong time. I'm probably going to get the thief or spell blade profession from Boris. There's something. There's a barrel over here that has like 20 repair hammers in it, I think. They have a repair hammer. Uh, no, just eight eight things of rat meat. Later. I have no uh I have no quarrel with you goblins. Okay. Now we're done fighting goblins. Although I didn't fight any goblins. Mm-hmm. Okay. Working our way through. It's that prisoner against. Yeah. No, she is not one of them. She can help us. She must help us. They cannot understand. Mm -hmm. Yep. I, the Nine, guide and protect us. I've served the Nine all my... I'm peaceful. I okay, let's start. We're going to pick the Mage for now, but I'm probably going to switch to the Atronach at the end of the sewers. The signs I read show the end of my path. Uh-huh. What about me? Your stars are not mine. It's true. Aren't you afraid to die? No trophies of my triumphs precede me. But I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood. They know their doom, but not This guy hour. actually lived a really fucked up life. In this, I am blessed to see the hour of my death. Plus all his children just to died, face except my one. Portion fate, then fall. Ah, uh, sure. My dreams grant me no opportunity uh. in your face. With such hope, I go to my grave. A tongue shriller than all the music calls me. Sure. You shall follow. Make yourself useful. Here's you a torch. You may as well make yourself useful here. Stick close and let us do our job. We will do that. We're going to stick. This is going to be a case in point of how we're going to get through Oblivion. Is uh, we aren't going to kill anyone, but these three certainly are. I would believe there was references to Daggerfall, sure. But I'm going to hide silently. No one will know I am here. Why are they running after me? Protect the Emperor! Uh, you thought we'd go down easy? 
No, fight, fight the three people with swords. I am no threat. I'm just pause. Peace, angels, and isles. Okay, we're almost through the tutorial. Strike them! Protect the Emperor! Uh. There's, there's another one up here to the right. Yep. Give me your potions. This way. If only Glenroy wouldn't die. Yeah, this is, uh, I love this game. It's very good. I think this game holds up. It's just you'll like it more if you like the jank. It's like, people still like Skyrim in that game. Also extreme jank. I think the visuals of this game, except for the faces, have also held up. Like, these environments look nice, I think. And they have more of a style than Skyrim does. But the environments of Skyrim also held up pretty well. What about that side passage back there? Worth a try. Let's go. Okay, so we might actually need to... No, we won't need to use our daily power, I don't think. It's a dead end. What's your call, sir? I don't know. I don't see any good options here. They're behind us. Wait here, sire. Wait here with the Emperor. Guard him with your life. Sure will. I'll block the hole from which the assassin will come. I can go no further. You yep. alone must stand against the Prince of Destruction uh -huh. and his mortal servants. Mm -hmm. He must not have the Amulet of Kings. Yes. Take the Amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Find him and close shut the jaws of oblivion. I think you said that in the opening intro. Oh, Stranger, go down easy. you chose a bad day. Boris, help me. The amulet of you thought we'd go down easy. I'll take Glenroy's uh, subway fare. Yeah, that guy has. That's the assassin. You can tell because he has shoes. We failed. Yep, you sure the did fail. I have it. Strange. Mm -hmm. They say it's the dragon blood that flows through the Dovahkiin. The amulet of kings is a sacred symbol of the empire. The amulet has. He must. I must take it to Joffrey. Joffrey. Yeah, he's at Wayne and Priory. Yes. Nothing I ever heard about. Although you may not. First, you need to get out of here. Uh -huh. It's a secret way out of the. Here, you'll need this. So what are we? What is he going to call us? There are rats and goblins down there. But from what I've seen of you, I'm guessing you're an experienced assassin. Am I right? Hmm, yes, an assassin. Yes, that's us. I need to look something up, though. Uh... Okay, I know what the name of our class is going to be, but we'll just pick assassin for now. Yes, this is a sat. We are an assassin. I thought so. A few rats and goblins won't give you any trouble. You must get the amulet to Joffrey. I understand. Oh. Guard the Emperor's body. Yep. Mm -hmm. Dunbarrow Cove. That's for bad people. Horse armor. And into the sewers we go. And again, we have killed no one, assaulted and murdered no one. Uh, Peace Angels and Isles remains pure. Cross Crag Spire. That one's going to be incredibly useful. Maroon's uh, Razor, perhaps less useful. Here's a rat. 
Now here's a fun thing. There's gonna be a rat up here too. They're going to de-aggro from me when I click on this. So I can make... I can make our first game save here and the rats have de-aggroed. Okay. First things first, we're going to change our birth sign. We are going to be the Atronach, which is going to make things a little awkward, but we are going to make do. Uh, so we're going to have a lot of ma we're going to have a lot of magicka, but we're going to have to find a way to improve our magicka. We're going to change our class. So let's find let's find a fitting picture for our class. Which one of these is the most a uh, healer looks the most peaceful? Monk is very bilious. Wizard has fire. Pilgrim has a uh, has a mace. Rogue it looks pretty peaceful. Scout has a flower. That's very peaceful. Uh, this guy's got some incense. A thief, ha well, he's got a bow. It's not very peaceful at all. Now, we'll go with healer. We just got our vape out. But we're going to make a custom class. And we are going to pick magic as our specialization. Then we are going to pick our favorite attributes, which are going to be uh, intelligence... And what else? Willpower is pretty worthless. It might be personality or it might be luck. Or speed. It might be speed. It's luck or speed. Let's go with luck. Very lucky. Okay, seven major skills. So here is, uh, here's what's going to look weird. We're going to pick for our major skills. Heavy armor. Light armor. Hand-to-hand. -hand. Block. Actually, wait. No, 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 no. We definitely want block. And I think we want armorer. Light armor. And then blade. Blunt. Actually, hold on. I have to pick ones that will let me level up, but not too fast. I'm like deliberately picking skills that I won't use that much that I can use in a very controllable way. Actually, maybe Conjuration, because I'm not going to be using um, Summon Spells that much. So, let me, let, me go, let me go back for a second. Yeah, Conjuration is good, yes. Yeah, we're, we're doing whack shit to the leveling system. So, we'll pick Blade and Blunt and Hand to Hand and Marksman. Okay, now we're good. So our actual um, skills we'll use to level up are Armorer, Block, and Conjuration. And we'll probably just use Skill Trainers for those, to be quite honest. Uh, 
and the name of our class is going to be there we go that's the name of the song right Yeah, there we go. That's the song that, that Paz sings. Create love deterrence class? Yes. We're going to deter all of the sins of the world using love. I sure, I'm definitely sure I want to be a love deterrence. Okay. So here's our character now. Why is it like this? I might remake the class just to remake the name. Is it going to make me pick all this shit again? I mean, I kind of... Oh, it's because I hit Alt-Tab to, uh, Google. Yes. Yes, okay. How's that look? Yeah, there we go. Nice and centered. Now look how much Magicka we have. That is a lot. Okay. Peace. I have to cough again. Ugh. Okay, let's grease this pig. So. We're going to start off kind of like how to make real ultimate power. Which means that... Um, The first thing I want to do is go to Anvil. Yeah, let's piece this pig, indeed. We're going to run along at the speed of sound. There's an item over here that will give us a lot of money. Yeah, we gotta get the awful hat that makes things blue. Make some frame hitches happen. So we're going to get a useful hat. Uh, no stars shine among upon this doomstone. I need to find out what day the... Uh, my frame rate always seems worse in third person. Uh, uh, here's some useful alchemy ingredients. I don't know how much alchemy I'm going to be using. Because some of the big usages of alchemy is poisons. Uh, there aren't many hireable companions that uh, I can use. But I guess one of the first things we can do is go and test to see if a follower NPC's kills count as yours. Which would be fairly academic to check. Is it a slaughterfish or a crab who's after me? Okay. Time to die a couple times. Is that it? Put it on so I don't die. Ah! Is 
So this is Fin Gleam. It's one of the f be it's one of the most expensive uh, items you can find at the beginning of the game. It's a, gl a glass helmet, which is in-game gear that has some useful, if annoying, enchantments on it. I don't exactly know how the person who died with Fin Gleam on died. They appear to have been dead at the bottom of the s of the bay, but it couldn't have been from drowning. Yeah, Slaughterfish is the only thing that makes sense. Because they couldn't have drowned. They were wearing Fin Gleam. Crabs. What time is it? Only 2.30. It's the, it's the best time to visit the dentist. What is it now? Hear me! My oh, children are starving. Please. So we're going to go to the Mages Guild. This is among the first things we're going to want to do. I believe the Mages Guild is right here. This is the Fighters Guild. Yeah, the Mages Guild is here. Because we're going to need, among other things, uh, money. Hello. You ever steal something trying to talk to somebody? Hello there. As long as you're not a... Yes, I want to join right. the guild. Can you'll need... Okay, thanks. Take care. Oh, hello. What's going on with you? I Actually, I am going to need to steal. I want I need to get behind you, felon. Stop looking at me. Don't observe me. There's easier people to steal from than you. I'm felt. Um. Persuade. Sir. Okay, they're already maxed. I it's offer the Spartan. finest goods and lowest prices in all Cyrodiil. Yep. What's up? Uh, a good. Let's sell our crap. You've made. A Get some seed You've money. A good bit of gold. Okay. Do you have any scrolls? No, you are worthless to me. I need some scrolls. Good afternoon. What's new with you? I saw some mud crabs by the water recently. I steered clear of them. I can't stand the sight of those. How do you? I greet you. Uh, nobody here might have scrolls. I might need to go to. Can uh, I interest you in? Some yeah, I might need to go Bye. to the Imperial City for this, but I need to join the Mages Guild anyways. Uh, F3, 4. Yeah, let's go to the Imperial City Market District. Yes, here we go. So normally the next thing I would do would be to go to... Uh, ugh, it's the wrong time of day. Have my ear, citizen. I do have your ear. Not first edition. We are looking for... Like, honestly, Jins, uh, uh, Jinsene would probably have some scrolls, but the place with the Frost Crag Spire Lady would be the best place to go. Which is over here. The Mystic Emporium. Here's Edgar's Discount Spells, Rindir's Stabs, and over here will be the Mystic Emporium. But I've got to wait for it to open, which is in like 12 hours. Hello. Welcome to. Can I persuade you, any? Okay. 
Uh, we're gonna have a lot of money, so I'll just bribe uh, you. What a thought. What? See, was that hard? Okay. Can I interest you? Have a look around. Haggle. Let's try here. I wouldn't make that deal. Oh, I don't have enough gold. Well, can you buy some stuff? Um, Have that much money. Okay. Now it is time for the ritual to begin. A pleasure. Now, what's your buy and sell limit, actually? You, of course. Have a look around. You won't find better. A thousand. Okay. If you will, he'll buy my fin gleam, so he's better than the person at attack and slash. So once again. We will... I forgot how to do this exactly. Okay, there's really nothing to do. You just do it. Okay. Hello? Have a look around. You won't find better prices in all Tamriel. That's a good... And now we're, we have lots of money. That's more. That's literally all there is to it. But before we do that, to really get cooking, first you must duplicate your duplicators. She doesn't like me very much. I don't like you. So all you do is equip a scroll and then drop another item. It is just that simple. And you duplicate as many items as you have of the scroll. So, it's incredibly dumb and easy to use. There's nothing to it. There used to be a more convoluted way of duping items that involved arrows. Okay, let's barter. Let's do business. How many of my helmets do you want to buy? I have to sell them one at a time. No. I've created clicking for myself. Can we buy these two? That's a good and ec that's more. Got a great After this, we won't have to worry about money That's for a while. I... That's more. A fine. You drive up. That's more. Gotta sell our dumb hats. Sell our dumb hats. 
Selling all our dumb hats, except for one. We need a seed hat, from which all other hats spring. This hat is known as Hat Prime. The original, the unalterable. The Finleam. Which all our economy crashing gold springs. Although really, it's Carahill's fault. I'm not the one generating the gold. Car uh, uh, Calendil just has all of this gold sitting around. He's That's got some fair. kind of uh, racket going. Okay, so we've got 34,000 gold. Come back. Goodbye. Uh, do you have any spells Good. I want, actually? Have a look around. You won't find better prices in all Tamriel. Uh huh. Yes. Should you wait? Can I do better now? I can't make that. I can't make that. Touch of rage. Starlight. That might be useful. Okay. Thank. Bye. Let's pick up some spells and also some clues. You've come. Have a look around. You won't find better prices mm. in all Tamriel. Nothing zero weight. We're going to have to find zero weight clothes. There's a list of zero eight clothes somewhere. All this stuff is free, so there's no reason not to pick it up. Paintbrush. I'm picking up two golds, even though I have 33,000. That's just how greedy I am. Best defense, gilded craft, slash, and uh, let's go to uh, Edgar's discount spells. Edgar Votrine. Yes. Have a look at my wares. I'm sure there's something mm -hmm. to suit you. Actually, do want this. Uh huh. Actually, wait, I could have done this. I mean, it, it scarcely matters. Just buying a bunch of garbage stuff we don't really I need. Be seeing you. Okay. So there's going to be some oh. stuff Hello. I need spell wise. And the place to go will be Breville. But I can pick up some stuff while I'm here. Yes. This guy doesn't like me. Ah, uh, let's do business. Hmm. Eh, I'll just buy some rings. I'll buy a nice ring. Yeah, buy one of these. Jade Ruby Ring. I wouldn't make that deal with just any There we go. You too. Actually, wait. There might be stuff that weighs less, but okay, we're going to go. Well, first, I'm going to alt tab out. Because I got to know what tonight's the. How you say. Shade of the Revenant shows up. Last seed. Oh, I've already missed it.
So I'm going to have to wait till Heart Fire 4. That's fine. Yeah, last seed, 27. Next one is Heart Fire 4. Uh, so I have plenty of time to dick around. Which means the first thing I can do is go to Coral. Coral has the easiest Grand Soul Gem to get. I'm going to do this for a second. Okay, there we go. Don't know if that helped anything or not, but I've, I've done it. Hi there. Some of these people might even have spells I want. Tika doesn't actually sell spells. A pleasure to you don't either. Or maybe people have just... People are going home for the day, maybe. Excuse me. Yeah, that's what's happening. Take care. Okay. Time to pick a very hard lock. The weird thing is, this isn't even the, like, least... As far as lockpicking minigames go, this is actually medium realistic. If I had another pick in, like, uh... If I had something to put tension on the lever... This is basically how lockpicking works. Except your lockpicks don't really break very easily. My lockpick is made out of a windshield wiper. I need to get a new lock to practice on. I think the... The spring in most of... A lot of the pin springs broke in the very old master lock I practice on. So these aren't actually stealing to take because I'm in the guild. None of these are good. Okay, next stop. Breville. Uh, yeah, here. I think I want to go over here. Here's... What is it? Yeah, Renum. And now we're going to partake of an ancient tradition. Delphi oh, they're actually here to do stuff okay I interest you in some of my fine wares Buying, I thought we were going to do a, another grand thing of just hanging out in uh, mages guilds foyers uh, do I have a no, I'll take a shield spell sure enemies explode frenzy
Okay. Come back. Be seeing you. Oh, do I have follower chat? Oh, yeah, I turned follower chat on because of the bot raids a while back. I finally got you to follow, though, TK Cat. You've been watching for long enough. I have potions and everything you need to make your own. Sure, I'll buy. I could have just bought a Grand Soul Gym here. Okay. Be seeing you. Uh, I need to go to Shade and all. I'll make a pit stop up here. Even though I think I'm going to be attacked by a wolf. But there's a enchanted ring up here. And I can get some poison apples. Even though I don't know what I would use them for. I guess I can test to see if killing someone with poison apples is assault or murder. But because of Fin Gleam, I don't need to do this for money. There we go. This is not the best way up here. Well, the way you give people the poison apple is by sticking it in their pocket when they don't realize it. We have the Ring of Speed. It's one of the only enchanted items just hanging out in the world for you to get. Legend of Speed Bones. I kind of miss DMing. The last time I had a campaign go for a long time, they actually met and fought Speed Bones, the world's fastest skeleton. There we go. Let's get some apples for the road. What do you do? Who knows? Okay, let's get out of here. So what? What's what? What does what does Paz have to her name now? No, no creatures killed. No assault or murder. One place discovered. Yes. Now it's finally time to go wait in the Mage Guild lobby because I really need a soul trap. Oh no, I'm going to have to grind mysticism because I can't cast soul trap, can I? Oh, so I forgot where the Mage's Guild is. It's up here. The lack of MG, MP regen is fine Good day. because uh, I can. Do, here's why playing Atronach is easy.
Yeah. <laughs> Okay, time to wait in the Mage Hall. Yeah, we are definitely going to chug to get charged. Like, literally, that's what we will be doing. Okay, you. I'm Trey. We don't. My. I, what can I interest you with? In? You have Soul Trap. What do you actually train mysticism with? Probably... Do I have uh, Detect Life? No, where do I get it? The guy in... I could have gotten it from... Do any of these people are in... Mystic Emporium. Leowen. Edgar's Discount Spells had it. Burville. Okay, we've got time to kill. So that doesn't, that doesn't matter that much. So I guess we're going to the market district. And I think I know what we're going to do after this. Last seed nine. So we have plenty of time. Let's go to Rindir Staffs. See if there's anything good in here. You're in Rin. Let's do business. Mage's Hood, zero eight. That's a good deal. We will need that. Here's Apotheosis, the most powerful staff in the game. But I need your finest detect life what? spell. Can I interest you in some of my wares? You don't have it? You too. A pleasure to only quality goods. Have a look around. You won't find better prices in all Tamriel. What's the actual spell called? Minor life detection. Did I already buy it? Yes. You too. Let's let's try on our mage's hood that I just bought. Dress dressy accessory. Now we go to Skin Grad. Go ahead. Do I have anything stolen in my inventory? No, all of this stuff was fairly gained. Honest, honest earned goods. Well met. I trust you have... I'm afraid I haven't given it much thought. I'm rather busy, you understand. Now that I think about it, I... Yes, I'll do it. Excellent. I just don't have the time to search for him again. You might want to ask around and... Okay, we'll ask about Earthor. When he gets back, is it? What? Earthor. I haven't seen him in quite... Yeah. Bye. 
You want me? Earth War. He hasn't shown up here in a while. I assumed he was still out at Bleak Flats Cave. What can I? I don't remember where it is, honestly. Yeah, we gotta go to True, huh? Bye. That's her. What? It's just northwest of Skingrad. That's where Earthor wound up after Adrian told him he couldn't practice in the guild. You might want to make sure she remembered. Okay. Good luck finding. You're here. Oh, I do remember telling him to go there. Mm. Well, by we, I mean you, of course. I have something. I'll be here when you get. Okay. And what we're going to do is we're going to have a problem. Uh, will there be guards out here? I need a guard. Okay, first I have to go here and... Uh, I have to pick my quest. There we go. Yeah, we have a fireball spell, not the greatest. Stop right there, then pay with your blood. So, um, there's going to be a lot of zombies in this cave. And I don't want to fight them. And I don't have anybody who can fight them for me. And really, it shouldn't be considered killing because they're zombies. But... I just don't like doing anything violent so I just had a good look in that guy's pockets you know he's being attacked by a wolf right now Attack him, not me. Let's get him some more zombies to fight. if this will work. No, my, what's my illusion skill at? 15. Not good Die. enough. Luckily, I do have some things that'll help me out. Um. This. But also... There we go. This is the part. This ends here. Now that I remembered that, I'm actually going to load autosave. Because he lost a lot of health. Whoa. 
There we go. Do I have a heal other spell? No. No, come here. I need your help. Stop. Die, Kerr. Hello, zombies. Everybody get angry at Paz. I might need another cop. Nope, fuck. Okay. It's all then pay with your stop right. Did he die? He died. Okay, well. He didn't have any good uh, stuff on him. I'll need another cop. Look. I might need more than one cop. Okay, I have an idea. We're going to need to we're going to need to recruit more cops. Over here. What is it now? Yes. It's all Then Okay, here's some yes, cops. You. We need to talk. Please follow me. I'm just warming up, you pathetic worm. Let's see if two is enough. Do I have the right... Yeah, I have the right quest up. Yeah, my... The problem with using my rage spells is my illusion skill is too low at the moment. I'm going to have to improve it. Maybe that's what I should be doing now, but I want to try this, and I do... You paid the fine. No, don't switch to ranged. You'll never take me down. No, switch to bow. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Don't switch to bow. At least I'm getting my reps in for, uh, restoration. There we go. Uh, buddies? Where'd the other cop go? Let's get this over. 
There we are. Maybe two of them. I'm going in medium circles. Did I get both of them? Fuck, there they go. Uh, potion of healing. Turn. Make a save. Stop. Get the cops mad. Take that. Do your worst. Let's not do too many at a time. I kind of have to do it at a distance to make it work right. Do your worst. Uh, one of them died. I might need to go get some more cops. That's fine. That's doable. Take that. Show me what you've got. You're Okay, let's go get some more cops. Yeah, we're swatting the cave. Only, instead of calling the cops on... So There's another zombie over here. You're at full health. So I'm going to have to run away. We're going to have to kill all of the zombies for Earth Ore to follow us. Okay, gotta find some more cops. So we can play the... Also, while I'm do thinking about potions... We may as well just have that on tap too, right? I'm gonna need like two cops minimum maybe three if I can have it here's uno stop here's the dose if I switch up close they'll switch to melee 
And the question, of course, is can I survive having three cops following me? And I think I can. No, no, that guy switched to ranged. Okay. Yeah. Keep the melee, dudes. Here's another one. What's the actual way down here? Will they just follow me? Oh, they're over here. Yeah, switched up. There's a, there's a fourth one. Okay. Don't run away. We get close. One of them got damaged somehow. Like this guy... Okay. No, no, no. Switch to... Switch to... Switch to... There you go. Actually, I'm on the wrong side of the fence. Yep, we're backpedaling towards the cave of zombies so that we can get Earthor to follow us. to keep my boys close to me or else they'll switch to their stupid little bows like he tried to do I'm also going to have to get me rusty. Hmm. I forgot about me rusty. Me rusty is going to be important. No, no, no. Don't switch to ranged. Get your sword out, dumbass. How did you get so damaged? He looks almost dead. Was he getting shot by the other cops on accident? I'm getting lost somehow. Am I supposed to be impressed? Okay, here we go. Okay. Actually, that cop who is harmed might be the cop who was in the cave before. He might have gotten back to Skingrad by the time I... 
We had to run all the way back. I fought mud crabs more fearsome than you. I fought mud crabs more fearsome than you. Where's the other cop at? Okay. Stay away. Here's Earthor. Are all the zombies dead? It's all Let's pay our gold. That's too okay. Install the poop and pee mod. Wait, why are Oh I'm under fucking attack. A, 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 a conjurer is attacking me. This was just a oh, this was just a a a, a guy who was aggroed onto me. And he followed me to jail <laughs> and attacked me as soon as I got out. Yeah, here's my boys. What is it now? Why do you... Now let's see if Earthor... If we killed all the zombies. If not, then I will reload that save. Because I think we killed all the zombies. Well met, Gil. They're all gone? I can leave the cave? Oh, thank you. I'm ever so grateful. You're heading back to Skingrad, aren't you? Could I... Oh, thank you. You're just too kind. Okay. I can't wait to be back in Skingrad. Safe and sound. Okay. Anything cool here? No? Okay. So, we're never going to turn in the quest for Earthor. He's not the most useful follower. I think he's actually a pretty big coward. But, he's the first one I could think of that I could get without having to go through any kind of special loops. So, now we've got a buddy. And now we need to see if Earthor's kills count as Paz's kills. Yeah, Pete is invincible. And he will help us. The question is, do we want Pete to help us? And we want to go somewhere around here. Can I activate this yet? Hmm, game crashed. Okay. This is going to happen, you know. Game's going to crash. It's going to crash again. Going through the Bethesda Softworks uh, thing. So our next goal, of course, is to get Black Soul Gems. Which, actually, 
how am I going to get human souls? I might have to get them inadvertently. Which is doable. Yeah, so we're not cool enough to click on these stones yet. Actually, I haven't... Uh... You can occasionally buy Phil's Grand Soul Gems. Uh, I have some, but they're greater, not uh, grand. Which means that's probably what we're going to have to make do with for now. Where's Earth Ore? I saw a wolf over here. Okay, here's Earth Ore. Earth Ore! I command you! Okay. Was this all worth it? That's... It's cool, baby. That's not us. Now. Uh. So, creatures killed, people killed, murders, assault. We're, we're cool. Now you might think, but no bit, doesn't this kind of make the challenge not that bad? And maybe, except followers really, really suck in this game. They're just tremendously bad. If Earthor goes up against something with even a little bit of weight behind it, for one, his ass is way over there. And for two, anything that can put up any kind of a fight is going to uh, be beyond Earthor's means. So really what Earthor represents for me is a way to get the ball rolling. I can make Earthor better eventually, but not really. And he's not really on my team. He's just, uh... Here's Meridia. They model her underwear. Kind of looks like her crotch disappears underneath. Yeah, no ass. No ass Meridia. That is the way of the ancient Daedric Lord who hates undead. And the whole reason I needed Earth Ore is because at this place I want to go to, I'm going to get interrupted by rats. So I just need something that can, somebody who can murder the rats for me. We're coming up to Silent Moon's camp. I think that's the name of this camp. That'll be a real test for Earth Ore. You know, test for me, come to say, here's what I mean about Earth Ore. What did Talos' blessing even do for me? I mean, I can't even see. I don't know how you see what... Okay, plus st st 10 strength, it looks like, what Talos gave me. 
Okay, Erythor's picking a fight. Good job, Erythor. See what I mean about Earthor? He's uh he's running away. The cop got off his horse and killed the uh and killed the dog for us. I'm pretty sure Earthor ran out of mana there. So we're coming up here. This is where the Shade of the Revenant will appear. Here in Fort Istrius. But I don't know where Earthor is at, and I'm being chased by a dog, so I can't fast travel. If I get back to the road, maybe I can find that cop. And he can kill this dog for me. Yep, there he went. Here's Earthor. Earthor is very excited, so he's doing his slam dance. Goblin. Okay, Earthor is no longer doing his slam dance. Okay. So what do what do I need to do now? First things first. Our mysticism is at 20. It needs to be at 25. Which means it is time. How many how many uh magic potions do I have left? Restock on MP. Can I help you? Stop walking on my potions, cop. Okay. We need to do minor life protection. Glorious. I dropped all my potions, so they are no longer on my three key. Yep, 
Yeah, purple is the color of his energy. How much does each one of these cast to raise mysticism? So it's 74. Yeah, 14. Now it's a 2. Yeah, it's 13 now. Now we are of mysticism 25. Which means I can cast Soul Trap now. Which is the whole reason we did this. So now let's go back to Fort Istris. There might be a skeleton here. And I think Earthor is just going to run towards us. When can I wait? When can I wait? Where is Earthor at? Earthor. Okay, so we're going to have to wait several days. There's Earth Ore. So we're looking for the fourth. Or rather, midnight on 1159 on Heartfire 3 is what we are looking for. Yeah, we're just waiting on this rock. That's pause, pause six. There we go. Now we head on back down to here. Here's Earthor. There's a skeleton over here that Earthor is hating on. Where's the enemy at that's keeping me from waiting? Up oh, there it is. There's the Shade of the Revenant. This is the Shade of Manamarco, King of Worms. Bam. Hey, Earthor, you're in the Mages Guild, right? Do you mind me, like, uh, making some black soul gems? This is totally against the Mages Guild charter, right? I hope we'll get to Skingrad soon. I've had enough of the wilderness for now. I'll be right behind you. I can't wait to be back in Skingrad. Safe and safe. That's all Earthor has for us. 
Okay. So I think the next thing to do... ...is to go to the Imperial City Market District. And let's have Earthor wait here in the middle of the road. I hope we'll... Okay, if you say so. I can't wait to be back in skin ground, safe and sound. Because we're going to do some stupid shit as the last thing we do today. So the last thing we would do is we have our black soul gems. Actually, no. Wait. Let's find a nice corner that I can dump a bunch of shit into. Everything I have that weighs the most. I need to make weight. Okay, so here's our trash pile. Now, we go to Frost Crack Spire. And if, it, if everybody, any, if ever, anybody remembers the old tricks we pulled in Frost Crag Spire during the stream where I showed the game off to Slyo9, we're going to be performing that stuff again. Because I want to invest in Frostcrag Spire. Which means... We gotta wait for this to open up. Which means, if I'm going to be... I don't want to invest in it, then uninstall the module, and then reinstall it and lose all my progress. So we need to go to the Pizza Realm. Somewhere around here, by the Harada Roots. We quit the game. I'm going to go into Mod Manager and un, un, un select the Frostcrag DLC Frostcrag.esp. You'll run Oblivion again. So now the zone we were in no longer exists because the ESP that contains the data for that area is not loaded. And the opening movies are not going to want to load. There we go. Now we're gonna we're gonna load pizza. Hmm. Now, if I did this right, we're here. If you've never seen this before, this is one of my favorite exploits you can do in the entire game.
Ta-da! I mean, I guess I can take the Mace of Doom. I might give it to a follower eventually. But that's not what we're here for. Tester House Bruma Mid. This might be medium difficult because of how little health we have. But I have to try. That might have been not enough. Yeah, that wasn't enough. Oh, I know how to avoid the fall damage. Ah. Oh, I landed on spikes. Ha ha ha. Does this not work in this game? This works in both New Vegas and Fallout 3. Work. I just missed it that time. Landing on spikes. <laughs> okay, quick saving apparently doesn't work in Oblivion. Oh, I know what I can do. Oh, I hope this works. The paintbrush. Piss. Whoa. I'm just in a really bad position, apparently. Oh, the paintbrush is like pushing me. What's happening? Ah. One of these days I'll live. So I need to jump forward and then back. That's not going to work.
What a pickle. Actually, wait, not a pickle. If one paintbrush didn't help, what about 30? We're solving the puzzle. If only it wasn't so dark in here. Do I have a light spell? work here. Okay. We're making it happen. We are creating problems to solve. We are invincible. We are beautiful. We are powerful. We are wonderful. We are dying. No, we did not. We did not die. That's too high up. Okay. This was never a glitch I actually used with Granny Smith. Lighting in here is so weird. Especially because I think the lighting effect on them has died now that uh, I, I loaded.
This is so weird and dumb. I'm dropping new paintbrushes to see where the old paintbrushes were. Maybe having like intermediate paint brushes is a good idea. jump okay fuck oh god okay not good enough uh, we are we're trapped in the hell dimension now. Whoa. There we go. So now we have a uh, So now we have as much fame as we will ever need. And a bunch of orbs. And the first thing we're going to do with the orbs. These orbs aren't actually very good. But they might pass for now. There we go. a few more and we'll be able to leave with our orbs. Guess I'm doing it with Jade Ruby Ring. Okay. So now we can leave. And we can always come back later and get orbs of a greater stature. Although, if I do that, I'll have to redo everything in Frostcrack Spire, but that's fine. I don't give a shit about that. It's time to leave. And the way we leave is by going to 
Wild Eye Stables. We're going to quit out again. Re-enable Frost Crag Spire. Load back in and we're going to drop off our orbs. And then we're going to call it a stream. I like that you can hear the other, the Zinimax thing play. Yes, make this my active quest. We have many orbs to drop off. I like it when you time your jump right and you... We just kind of go. Yeah, we cast some fucking spells, didn't we? Okay, time to drop a shitload of orbs. Actually, no, this is wrong. Is there a container in the living area? Not really. Because I don't have any of the upgrades purchased yet. So no, the, the stones are just going to have to just go on the fucking ground. And when I buy a... Actually, no. I can't store the balls here. Because when I upgrade the when I upgrade the things in the market district, uh, it'll reload the cell and possibly destroy my shit. Which means if I really wanted to store things, I would go to testing hall. But is all my shit still here? Yes. A little bit more waiting. I got clipped into the uh, wall by an errant fin gleam. <laughs> what can I do? We'll see. That will get you something. Can I interest you? Who bought that? Who bought that? A fine bo Come back. Will she buy Fingleam? Well, I have a look at my way. I'm sure. No, she won't. I still have Fin Gleam, right? I do. I'll, I'll pick up a spare, though. I guess I won't, actually. Okay, now we can go to Frost Crag Spire. And drop off our shit. So I'm going to have to rebuy everything I've rebought later if I want to use the Orb Factory to produce higher quality orbs. But I can plan for that eventuality.
So right now we're in the middle of an extended power-up sequence. Where we are preparing our character for the troubles that will come. I'm just going to presume all of the containers in here are safe. Man, this UI. Clickety, 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 click. Let's go ahead and store one Black Soul Gem in here as well. And then we can come on down here. Leave them here by, actually, yeah, I'll leave these all over here. They're not filled. I guess I'll go pick up Earth Ore. So. We've got some stuff to do in our future. And I have to figure out exactly what that stuff is. What is that? There's just like a hole. I hope we'll. I'll. You've got Earth Ore. I can't wait to be back in Skin safe and sound. So I have to figure out what exactly I want to do with this run. My goal is to beat the game. I don't really have many goals besides that. So I have to figure out what tools I need and what I can do to uh, to get those tools. And I think the first thing I need to do is I need to get mysticism up to at least 33. And I need to get illusion up to as high as it can get. We're going to have to master illusion. And I think we are going to have to uh, level up a lot. It's just not going... We're going to need things that cannot be garnered at low levels. Which is a shame, but we'll have to do it. But for now... Let us make sure that we are clean and we are holy. We have killed no creatures. We have killed no people. We have committed no assaults and we have committed no murders. And here's something that's going to help us a lot in the future. Ah, uh, hello. What spell do I have? Frenzy, yeah. I have to find somebody of low level. But, uh, Frenzy? They're not raging. Hmm. But anyways, um, that was an assault. Even though it affected them. I don't know why they're not fighting anybody, though. 
I guess they just didn't feel like it. But that's going to be it for now. I don't really have an idea of schedule for how often I'm going to do this. I'm probably just going to do it when I feel like it. Also, we got to get some fucking gear. Look at this stupid ass outfit. This is dumb. Thanks for joining, everybody. That's going to be it for now. Thanks to Teen Wolf Dad and Asterisk, Asterisk for the subs. And thanks to the followers for the followers. But for now, good night.